Allen's getting our lunch ready. Yeah, I got it good on my girl. What's on the menu today? We got a jerk chicken, jerk pork, barbecue, chicken, rice, and peas. But that was jerk sauce and barbecue sauce all day, so you get hungry. I'm in town today. Yeah. Yeah, he in town today. We are really enjoying this vacation. And we are enjoying it together. Shauna, so far, what would you say was your favorite part? Really, what was your favorite part? <laughs> my every morning, waking up to the beach, my favorite part. I think, I really enjoyed trying to do a headstand on the paddle board. I want to do more of that. We're thinking Friday morning, I may take them out and do a paddleboard yoga class. I'm gonna be the instructor. <laughs> Cause that's I play instructor on TV. So I'm gonna teach them. We're gonna go through the 26 Bikram yoga poses on the paddleboard to the best of our ability. Try to modify them as much as we can. And we're gonna do it in the more shallower part of the water. Whereas when you can fall off the board, you can actually touch the bottom so it'll be easier to get back on the board. I fell off the board a couple of times the other day. Was that yesterday? Yesterday. Trying to do headstands and some other moves deeper in the ocean. So every time I fell, there was no touching the bottom. And getting back on the board was hard. Work, work. Yeah, so. Work, 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 work. work yeah, work. but we're going to try to do one set of each pose modified for the board. I've really been enjoying our excursion so far. Everything's been different. Everything's been different. Um, We're still trying to figure out the mystery to the glistening waters. Still smelling the glistening waters. It smells like boo-boo, honestly. That stuff stinks. When it gets in your clothes and your hair, like, you don't smell it at the water, like in the water and swimming, you don't smell it. It's when you come home and then it's like, oh my God. Yeah, I, we don't know what we were swimming in, but. I liked, um, oh, what I enjoyed about Rick's Cafe, I enjoyed watching Shauna and Gwen jump. That was good. Um, every time we've been before, no one's ever jumped. I'm, I don't know, I might jump, but it was fun being a spectator and just watching them jump and getting to live vicariously through them and watching this one here. She's a really good swimmer. I was like, look at her. She just bobbing on that water like she's unsinkable. Like, yes, you like, you just, you can sink. And then I was watching you tread the water because it takes a minute just to make it to the ladder. Like there's so many people lined up to get on that one ladder that I was like, oh, look at her. She's treading water. She's not even going to drown. I would have drowned by then. <laughs> so what would you say has been your favorite part so far honestly, of the vacation? Honestly, it's the impromptu things. And like I said, the first one was when we got to get on the glass bottom boat that was a good free. one too and because of that we, we went snorkeling we did things we went to see the nude people right and these, morning. Hello. these are all the things that we didn't even have on our list on our do. list and it just happened so it's still those moments anything impromptu yeah just happened you know we went to alfred's and um, rudy all the free drinks yeah he just hooks us up and you know because we've been here this is, our fourth time. this is our fourth time. So it feels like coming home and you see people that you actually know and they remember you, you remember them and right. you know, That's and they, and it's not about the money. It's not about what can we get from them. It's like, this is not the house. We can be like, we don't want anything. And they still putting drinks in front of us and it's all good, which is so cool. I don't, I forgot it at breakfast. Yeah. Day, what's today? Today is Wednesday. Mm, mm, mm. So we've been here Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, day five. We are about to go on our day five adventure. We're doing a pub crawl. Um, this is One Love Pub Tour Bus something. And the price is free 99 All we have to do is give a donation. Yeah, and we will go to about maybe seven, eight different bars. Yeah, and it's five of us so we have a strategy because we're not big heavy drinkers but we do love to support local businesses so normally maybe one 
maybe two if we feeling froggy people will get a drink per bar yeah, so not all of us every bar and um this is an, also a nice good little way to see the grill on a cheap cheap and that's gonna be fun these things right here i'm not sure these little red things i had them before i think that's what they were and i think that they taste like peanut butter but that could be poison it could kill us i don't know but it could be the peanut butter ones i'll ask somebody when i see them and if that is the peanut butter ones we're gonna all eat it all right y'all the bus is here <laughs> we're about to go get drunk <laughs> Bus. Here's the bus. Here's the people on the bus. Woo. Don't worry. Hi, everybody. Hi. These are my drinking buddies. <laughs> We are at our first bar. Here's the passing out. <laughs> I'm a lightweight. <laughs> teach us. We are at the first spot. Teach us. If we get a picture of all y'all in front of this bar, will you take one of us? Yeah. We sure will. We sure will. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're now at what's it called? The Horizon West. The Horizon West. I'm not gonna get a drink this bar. I bought a drink the last bar. Four dollars. Budget Life says. We don't even buy drinks every bar. We actually take turns. And so right now what we're gonna do is take pictures. Look at this scenery though. This is gorgeous. Look at this. Look at Sadis. Yes, Sadis, yes. Woo. This is beautiful. All right, girl, yes. I'm on that. Look at that. This is like the side of Negril where there's like a lot of cliffs, like a lot of cliff things. So people who stay out this way, they experience more of the cliff beach life. Shauna wants to stand up there on the cl on the ledge. No, she wants to stand over here. Oh, hell yeah, no. thank you. <laughs> right there. That's good enough. No, you can't see. Just use your imagination. This is the way you avoid getting drinks. You just kind of get far, far away from the bar as possible. I'm about to take y'all to the bathroom. We're about to go to the bathroom. The bathroom. The bathroom. Hello. Hello. Bathroom. Oh, it's not, it's not bad in here at all. This door. Ah, oh, dang. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is like going through a Mayan ruin. Ugh. You could come down. <laughs> I just want <laughs> Oh, 
at us. Do your hair and then put your hands back down. Try to get her hair when it's up. Like, I know what you're saying. Mess with your hair. Yeah. Do it again. <laughs> yeah, just flip your hair. <laughs> now flip it back. Oh, don't even try. You just jumped off. Uh, you just jumped off this cafe. Don't get brand new all of a sudden. <laughs> Face, yeah. There you go. There you go. Arch your back, girl. Arch your back. She should get ready. Jump. No. <laughs> there you go. That's a cute one. Put your crush your hip out. Stick a hip out. <laughs> You're filming, Tisha. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Film, all right, Damn. film me over here. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> that's not Tisha, that's Virginia. I know. <laughs> she didn't learn my name. <laughs> Tisha sitting here like, I ain't even got the camera in my hand. Move, do something else, we got that. <laughs> do something else up here. Take one leg up in the air. Extabi, <laughs> Extabi. This is bar number three, y'all. Bar number three. Oh, nice, nice lady. And it's so pretty. I might even get a drink, Gregory. <laughs> I'm on the job. He's on the job. We met him last night, guys. Remember him? You're on. You're on TV. Oh, it's all good since this morning, this, this afternoon. So, are we getting a drink here? I don't know. I'm not. You know. That well, you got a drink at the last. One. I did, so I'm good. Budget life. I got a drink at the other one. Lambert. How many more do we have? We got four more. Four more. I gotta pace myself. You don't want me to be falling down drunk. Then you have to give me a piggyback ride on and off the bus. I certainly ain't try that. <laughs> we ain't ready for that. We ain't ready. We ain't ready. Ow, ow, ow. Let's go take a look at Extabi. Yeah, yeah. Won't you back it up? Oh, who do we see at the bar? Oh, but look at his look at the eyes he's giving you though. That should cost that should be good for a dollar, right? How much is the drink? It's too hot. Oh, y'all still doing poses? <laughs> they stupid. They reenacting all of the statues. Second in, Tisha. Come on. There you go. Now do that. Beautiful. Beautiful. You working. You better work. <laughs> you better. Because Uptown Funk's going to give it to you. Uptown Funk's going to oh, give it to that. you. Get that. Oh, she got that. It's on video. You know that. <laughs> it is in the spot. Don't believe me. Just watch. Oh! Oh, the black song was playing. Y'all couldn't come in here. Here, let's go look out here. Oh, to the caves. Don't believe me, just watch. Don't believe me, just watch. So I'm totally staying away from the bar. This is another way you save money and watch other people yeah. live their life. Wait, actually, Russell, hold on. So Russell, my new drinking buddy, yes, is going to jump sooner or later. Right as soon as she gets. Photo opportunity. 
Yes. You know, I forgot that on this pub tour, we could have totally been in our swim stuff. And we could have been swimming at every location, too. Forgot about that piece. And once again, this is how you do vacation on a budget. Every opportunity isn't always an opportunity to spend money. I mean, if drinking is your thing, you know, do what you do. Put that in your budget, knowing that you're a drinker. Here we are at spot number what? Four, five, two star. Five, two. I know. And what, C star? Next, next. Okay, let's hope they have some <laughs> seafood. I am starving. Hopefully they have something made already. That would be awesome. This is a pretty cute spot. Yeah, I don't think we've been here before. on a drink and we split and shared chicken fingers and fries. So that was ten dollars. Now we're here, Shanty Town. Our bus. It's starting to rain, man. That she's seen bags. Is that what it is, Gwen? Yes, ma'am. And we're gonna go look at the prices of the bags. Oh, wait. She thinks it's right around the corner. Hi, Mon. So, how much is your bag? Fifteen. You want to know U.S. C's? Yes. yes. Yeah, just like twelve dollars. Twelve. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This is another new spot. Gotta watch my step. Oh, Mm 
and this is stop number six. Six or seven to watch the sunset. This is Jamaica Man Negril. Hi everybody. Okay, so about last night in Jamaica, my budget wrap up is I spent $55. $27 of that was buying two bags, like souvenir bags, like backpack type bags. About $21 in food, $7 for the pub crawl tour that was just um, donations. Yeah, that's about it. And so that was $55. I don't think I'll be buying any more souvenirs or anything like that. So 